The premiere of the TV show, English in Chinese Time, marks a watershed moment in Burkina Faso's language education, signaling a bold move forward in embracing linguistic diversity and global connectivity. The innovative nature of this initiative has sparked widespread excitement and anticipation, reflecting a growing appreciation for the importance of English and Chinese proficiency in today's interconnected world. Burkina Faso demonstrates a commitment to providing accessible and engaging language acquisition opportunities on national television, empowering citizens with valuable skills for personal and professional development. The decision to concentrate on English and Chinese languages demonstrates Burkina Faso's recognition of their global significance in a variety of fields, including trade, diplomacy, and technology. As the show gains popularity and catches the attention of viewers across the country, it has the potential to foster a culture of multilingualism and cross-cultural understanding, enriching societal discourse and promoting international cooperation. Furthermore, the launch of English in Chinese Time represents a proactive approach to language education, utilizing television's accessibility and reach to break down learning barriers and promote linguistic diversity. The introduction of English and Chinese languages in Burkina Faso, a predominantly French-speaking country, marks a significant departure from traditional linguistic norms. However, rather than viewing this change as a challenge, many residents see it as an exciting opportunity to broaden their horizons and improve their skills in languages with significant global importance. English and Chinese are increasingly recognized as important languages in a variety of fields, particularly international organizations, trade, and diplomacy. As a result, knowing these languages not only makes communication easier, but it also opens up a world of possibilities, such as job opportunities, educational advancements, and cultural exchange. Burkina Faso's decision to broadcast English and Chinese language instruction on free-to-air television demonstrates the country's commitment to democratizing access to language education. Burkina Faso aims to equip its citizens with the tools they need to thrive in an increasingly interconnected world by making language learning accessible to all, regardless of socioeconomic status or geographic location. Furthermore, the recognition of the practical benefits of learning English and Chinese, such as increased job opportunities and educational access, drives public enthusiasm and encouragement for language acquisition. Overall, the introduction of English and Chinese languages in Burkina Faso is a positive step toward embracing linguistic diversity and promoting global engagement. This means that individuals from all socioeconomic backgrounds, including those who may not be able to afford traditional language courses or materials, now have the opportunity to learn these valuable languages from the comfort of their own homes. The English in Chinese Time program's innovative use of drama and comic plays entertains viewers while also serving as an effective educational tool for language acquisition. By combining entertainment and language learning, the program captures the attention of a wide range of viewers and makes the process of learning English and Chinese more enjoyable and accessible. Furthermore, by addressing relevant issues within the context of the plays, the program not only promotes language learning, but also encourages discussions on socially relevant topics, enriching the viewer experience. Beyond language acquisition, the impact of this initiative extends throughout Burkina Faso society, providing a path to empowerment and socioeconomic advancement for a larger segment of the population. Mastery of the English and Chinese languages opens up a plethora of opportunities, from finding work in international markets to participating in cross-border business ventures and cultural exchange. This initiative is a significant step toward providing individuals with the skills and knowledge required to thrive in an interconnected world, increasing their chances of personal growth, professional success, and meaningful participation in global discourse. The decision to broadcast English and Chinese language learning programs on national free-to-air television in Burkina Faso is a game-changing initiative with far-reaching implications for the country's socioeconomic landscape. English as the dominant language in international business, diplomacy, and academia provides access to a plethora of economic opportunities while also facilitating global communication. Burkina Faso is breaking down barriers to linguistic proficiency 
and empowering its citizens with valuable skills that are becoming increasingly important in today's interconnected world by making language education available to a wider audience via television programming. This initiative has the potential to usher in a more inclusive and prosperous future for Burkina Faso. By providing individuals with English and Chinese language skills, the country encourages greater participation in global discourse and facilitates engagement with international markets and opportunities. Furthermore, by democratizing access to language education, Burkina Faso promotes social mobility and empowers marginalized communities to pursue new opportunities for personal and professional development. Finally, this initiative is a significant step toward creating a more interconnected and resilient society in which individuals are equipped with the linguistic skills required to thrive in an increasingly interconnected global environment. Thanks for watching. Remember to like or leave a subscription so more people can see this.